What's going on everybody and welcome back to the channel. I'm Jordan Wheeler with RTR Vehicles and in today's video we are taking a look at the RTR Performance Shift Knob for your automatic 2015 and up S550 Mustang. Inside your box you'll find your RTR Performance Shifter, and your hardware pack, which includes shaft collar, return spring, zip tie, grease, flathead torque screws, and your button head torque screw. Tools needed for this installation are T20 Torx bit, a ratchet, Phillips head screwdriver, body clip removal tool, and two small diameter picks or precision screwdrivers. With the vehicle parked on level ground, move the shift arm into the neutral position. Using a plastic trim tool, carefully lift the shifter bezel and boot assembly out of the console by unseating the five plastic retention clips and raise the boot and bezel up to gain access to the base of the shift knob. On premium models, disconnect the two wire accent light harness. Using a short shank Phillips head screwdriver like this one from GearWrench, remove the two screws at the forward facing edge of the shifter base we will not be reusing these. You can now remove your shifter from the vehicle. Using our two picks or two standard head precision screwdrivers, depress the lock tabs in the shift boot cap. You can now remove the shifter from the boot and toss it and remove the cap. This will not be reused either. Insert the RTR shift knob into the boot and push to the first tier of the shift knob. You may need to use a small plastic trim tool or soapy water as a lubricant to ease the install. Pull the boot down to and completely around the edge of the groove in the RTR shift knob. Then use the supplied tie to secure the shift boot to the knob and trim the access length. The RTR shift collar has four screw holes in it. For this installation, we will only be using the number two and four holes. Slide the shaft collar onto the shifter arm with the spring cup on top and vertical groove facing the rear. Align the number two and four holes of the shift collar with the holes in the shift arm and use your T20 Torx driver to install the supplied flathead screws to secure the collar to the shaft. Next, use the RTR supplied grease to lubricate the shaft collar, shaft, and shift plunger. Then place the return spring into the cup of the shaft collar. Thread the button head screw into the shift knob by hand, leaving most of the threads exposed outside of the knob. Set the shift knob, boot, and bezel assembly on the shift arm and align the button head screw with the groove in the shaft collar. Push the shift knob down onto the shaft and using a T20 Torx driver, Carefully tighten the screw until the head makes contact with the knob and stops, making sure not to over tighten. The screw serves as a guide pin and limits travel of the knob in both directions. Verify the action by pushing down on the knob and releasing it. Align the retention clips on the bezel with the slots in the console and carefully reinstall the bezel assembly. You can now verify the function of the shifter by pressing the shift knob down and cycle the range selector forward and backward through the ranges, from park to sport. When released, the RTR knob will move upward and hold the range selected. With that verified, the job is done and you are ready to rock. Let's shift this thing into fun. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you like this product or any of the other great products we have available for your Mustang, F-150, Ranger, Bronco, Bronco Sport, or Mach-E, make sure to go ahead and click the link down in the description, which will take you to rtrvehicles.com, where you can shop from all these great parts or any of our fancy gear like I'm wearing right now. Since you're going to be scrolling down to that description anyway, to head over to rtrvehicles.com, on your way down there, go ahead and give this video a like, Make sure that you subscribe if you haven't already and hit those bell notifications so you don't miss any future updates from myself or the team. And if you guys haven't seen already, we also have a new studio that we're gonna be doing 
in-house reviews as well as having a few guests stop by, so you're not gonna wanna miss any of that. As always, I'm Jordan Wheeler with RTR Vehicles, making sure that you guys always are outfitted with the stuff that'll keep you ready to rock. Woo!